eerste gast uh, is hier. Ik spreek Engels met uh, mijn eerste gast. Hi, who are, who are you and what do you do? Uh, good morning, my name is Steve Ward. I'm a partner responsible for digital in Amsterdam, in our studio here. Yeah, um, uh, well, digital is, uh, everything is digital at yeah, the moment. Indeed. So uh, <laughs> in, in the past it was quite easy when we yeah. talked, uh, talked about digital. Uh, but what is the, the, the domain or the, the, the what, um, uh, well, where your most of your time goes into now? Yeah, obviously a lot of uh, the viewers and the, uh, cl our clients are experiencing huge transformation uh, agendas and disruption. So really our, our focus is on helping clients transform in, in what is what we feel, feel to be an era that's digital. Uh, so really helping them transform from where they are today, imagining the business of the future, delivering business to the future and running the business of the future yeah. and, and really helping them in that era. If you have to name one uh, important trend at the moment, what is that? There's lots of exponential trends out there, so it's difficult to pick one, but I, I think one that's really exciting us, and we've talked about this week in, uh, in some of our breakfast sessions, is, is IoT. And a lot of people talk about it, and really our, our discussion is on where the value is, and really moving from the what and the why to the how. So how to get started and move to what we say to be, you know, think big, uh, start small, scale fast, uh, is what we're... Uh, yeah. what we're yeah, and, uh, and uh, IoT is Internet of Things. Yep. Uh, the, the idea is everything uh, gets connected yep. uh, to the Internet. Everything then has data and what can you do with, with, with yep. all that stuff. Can you uh, give an, uh, a, a good example of one of your clients uh, th um, uh, that does something valuable with yep. IoT? So, so as you say, we're, we're moving from an era where we're connecting five and a half million new devices a day to the Internet. Uh, predicted there's 20 billion uh, devices connected to the Internet of Things. and what you're seeing is early adoption of the Internet of Things, and you're seeing that particularly in the B2B space. So a number of our clients in the industrial Internet of uh, Things, uh, whether it's GE globally or whether it's Caterpillar, um, are really starting to look at their logistics process, use sensor technology in that process to drive predictive maintenance and drive track and trace type use cases. So the value we're seeing at the moment is really from the industrial world, which is unlike the adoption of the Internet. Um, and gradually uh, organizations are starting to experiment in the B2C world. So, but we're seeing the value really uh, being tapped into in the industrial world, starting to see it in smart cities, but uh, retailers and the consumer goods uh, organizations really just piloting uh, IoT in, uh, in, in the B2C space. So really first value in the B2B space. Yeah. You said we're focusing now on the on the how. Yeah. Um, uh, why is that so important? Is it so difficult on to start? Uh, it, it, it is, in our view, quite a complex, uh, a complex term, but also a complex uh, direction. It's, it's really about demystifying what IoT means. Um, and, and our view is you really need to you know, think big as an organization, but also clearly identify where you want to play and look at the use cases that are being adopted in your, in your industry. Start small, um, you know, select a, a strategic IoT vendor to work with or advisor and really um, you know, start to think about cross-organization, cross-skilled teams within your organization to bring together, boot camp a number of ideas uh, really on the edge of your organization. So we work quite a lot with Singularity University here in the Netherlands and globally. It's all about innovating on the edge of your organization. And once you've incubated something on the edge, uh, you know, uh, scaling it to the core. Uh, talent is a huge uh, important aspect. So getting the right skills in place. It's not an IT agenda. This is something that's gonna transform your business. Uh, so you really have to have a multidisciplinary team in place. So it's, it's about that thinking big, starting small, uh, and scaling fast. And, and really today, uh, or today and previous days, we're really talking about the how uh, and getting the right, uh, right things in place for yourself as an organization. Yeah, because you talk about Singularity University. Yep. We were there as well a couple of weeks uh, ago at the summit in the Netherlands. And some of the Singularity University people on stage, of course, they say we abundance is the thing and in, fi and in five years every problem is, uh, is, is solved. Uh, yeah. that's, uh, that is, uh, I'm not sure <laughs> that's the case, but uh, I, know, I know exactly where uh, I've been to the same events. So <laughs> yeah, uh, but, but I very often have uh, over there have the idea, okay, uh, say, say it is true, uh, uh, but what does that mean for me? And you, of course, that's yeah. what, what you are doing yeah. uh, as well. And, and I sometimes have the, have the idea that the uh, front runners, the digital front runners, uh, are, uh, and, and, and the rest, the gap is getting so bigger. I sometimes yeah. have the idea. The gap is big between the front runners that understand the digital yeah. uh, area and, yeah. and the rest. Is, is, is that yeah, and, my and idea? Um, similar, we have an executive program with Singularity where we take normally boards from the Netherlands to, sing to Singularity University. And, and one of our key things is really. Uh, really getting the awareness in the boardroom first uh, that this exponential technology when combined 
will really will really change their business model and, and that they need to do something. So step one is really having the awareness you need to do something. Step two is then the how. Uh, and what we see and, and uh, with clients is that that transition to the how is all is one of the most complex complex piece because you're dealing with cultures and DNA within your organization that's been built up over years. So how to organize it and protect those change agents within your organization to drive change. Uh, we often see now organizations you know, setting up teams to disrupt themselves on the edge of their business, working with different skills outside the KPIs of the organization and really driving uh, the transform transformation from the edge, but doing it small, showing success not having a three-year transformation program uh, that after year one, you get the question from the board, what value have we driven? No, having faith in uh, experimenting and providing an environment for, uh, for, for change agents to grow. And that's no different for IoT. Now, IoT is one of many exponential technologies. So mm. whether that's augmented intelligence, which is very key to value in IoT. We see the value in IoT to be the information uh, and the, the ability that in that information brings to change your business model. Um, but that, that's, 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 that's the big question, I think, yeah. out there at the moment. Telling other people, helping other uh, companies to change is one thing. Yeah. Uh, but how difficult is it for your own organization? Because you're an old organization yourself as well. Indeed. Uh, and our business has been disrupted, whether it's uh, with uh, blockchain in our audit business. Uh, but we, we are actually, as Deloitte Digital, also at the edge of our Deloitte organization. So, you know, traditionally, we've not been seen in that space. We've got a huge uh, consulting group, uh, but digital is something we've uh, incubated over the last four years on the edge of our business. We've brought in creative people. The average number of tattoos in our business has gone up. Uh, but it's, more it's beards. A, more beards, indeed. Uh, but that's actually the, the great thing about bringing, I would say, left and right brain thinking together, that we can actually boot camp with our clients on imagining that business, the future, with the analytical consulting power that we've always had with the creative uh, experience that, that we bring in with new skills. Uh, and we're actually scaling that business at the moment. So here in Amsterdam, we're 150 people now and, uh, and you know, growing strong um, and really helping clients on their journey. So our, 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 our aim is to you know, be a steward for our clients in that uh, transformation journey. And it's digital is this era, but there's an exponential era coming. So if we're sitting here over five years time, we're probably talking about the exponential era and not the digital era anymore. It will be business as usual. Oké, okay. okay, thank you very much. Um, jullie bedankt voor het kijken. De hele dag zenden we uit vanaf ID uh, in Amsterdam. Uh, mede mogelijk gemaakt door uh, Deloitte uh, Digital. Um, ja, een stuk of twintig uh, interviews staan er wel op de agenda. Dus uh, blijf kijken. En als je vandaag verder geen tijd hebt, ze komen natuurlijk allemaal on-demand beschikbaar. Dus uh, je hoeft helemaal niks te missen. Dankjewel.